Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, today we have a nice geometry problem that was um, given to Vietnamese students from 12 to 13 years old. Today I have a creative solution uh, where you need to think outside the box. Um, so we have a rectangle with sides 17 and 26 and we have seven squares inside the rectangle, um, seven like equal squares, and we need to find uh, the area of one square. Um, so now, um, we can see here a right triangle um, with hypotenuse uh, equal to the side of the square. Let's say that this side will be A and this side will be B. And we can, um, in, for example, this side will be C. And we can use um, those sides A and B to measure um, vertical and horizontal, um, uh, like, uh, sides of this rectangle. So let's turn it like this and so we'll have here we have here like a right triangle the same thing we have C here so we turn it like this so this will be B and this will be A the same thing we can do it here this is B and this is A then we can do it here. We have B and A. And here we have B and A. So um, to uh, measure 17, we need one A um, and the second A is here. So 2A and 1, 2, and 3B. So plus 3B, this will be equal to 17. And we have system of equations because then um, we can actually construct another um, right triangle. This one. Okay, then this side is B, I mean this side is A, then um, we need to build one here, so this is B and this is A, and let's build one here, this is B and this is A. And let's build another one here. This is B, and this is A. So what we have here, we have, we have A, we have A, A, B, A, A, and B. So we have one, two, three, four, five, A, plus one, two, yes, one, two, B. And that is equal to 26. So we have the system of equations. We can solve it like, um, let's uh, multiply this one by two and this one by three. Okay, so we multiply this by two and uh, we have six A plus, I mean four A plus six B is equal to 34. Then we multiply this by three, so we have 15 A plus six uh, B that is equal to um, 
78. So um, we have here, um, again, a system of equations. So we need to, uh, to subtract the first equation from the second one. So we'll have here um, 11a equal to 44, and then a is equal to 4, and then like we can put um, 4 here and we'll get 8, so 3b is equal to 9 and b is equal to 4. I mean b is equal to 3. Um, and if b is equal to 3 and a is equal to 4, then we have 3, 4, 5, so c will be equal to 5, and c is the side of the square, so um, this will be equal to c squared, and this is 25. And that's the answer. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and don't forget to push the like button and subscribe my channel, and see you in the next video. Bye.